Who would like to recap that last session? Hmm. Well, we wasted uh, the whole hour. We messed around uh, trying to figure out what was going on with the whole like uh, barrier thing and trying to find um, find as much information as possible at the library before we finally packed up our things and uh, traveled to Archmouth. Yep. Found and got plot moving. Yep. Also, um, because Delta was not playing, we decided William accidentally sat on some sleep darts that I had been um, testing and uh, yep. trying to to maybe made a little bit too strong, and now he's in a coma. Yeah. Is he <laughs> your brilliant assistant? Oh, That's why William's got, not here, you know? He's we just get, in a coma. Didn't we get into... Didn't we... Um, wasn't there some stuff with Pippin? Last session. Oh yeah, you like, got a new party just, member, Pipwise Gamgians. Yeah, uh, he made his backstory during the session. <laughs> yeah, apparently uh, Jack just uh, teleported him in with the rest of us. Yep. Yeah. And now he's here. Yep. And we're stuck with him. He wanted to get through the barrier, but then he saw Aiko cut down trees. <laughs> <laughs> and at that moment, he oh. knew. I need to hire that person. Then we went... <laughs> okay, uh, what happened after we went to the city? Like, what happened at the city? I wasn't paying attention to that part. Like, well, the city seemed to be um, kind of in revolt. Like, lots of unrest amongst the citizens. Not very mm -hmm. many guards or uh, soldiers around. Yeah, we Sunny didn't some... like that barrier popping up out of nowhere. We followed mm. some leaf person. Yep. Dryad. That's right. Not dryad thing. Not dry Oh, out. that Benfix was chasing. She was looking for gnomes the whole session, yep. too. Well, I think Benfix found her, talked to her, and then stayed at the tavern, and then Helena snuck off, <laughs> yeah. and then got Echo's attention, who stuck off with her, and then sent messages back to Timothy to grab the rest of the party, and then we all ran through the forest after oh. this weird leaf thing. Uh, yep. before we went into the forest, Faye became untiny thanks to, uh, Timothy with, uh, was it lesser restoration or great restoration? Either way, it, um, fixed her tiny problem just in time for chaos. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. So then we are in the forest, and we immediately, uh, did, did we immediately see the mysterious pool, or was it something right before that? Well, we, well, like, came across some other things in the forest. Yeah, uh, yeah. Fainfates was chasing after some gnome voices. For uh, ages. Yeah. You were literally just strung along with the thought of gnomes. Uh-huh. Hey, Fainfates is lonely, and she's looking for some gnome friends. <laughs> you dense motherfucker! <laughs> she's trying to get to know Fainfates just wants to be amongst her people. Yeah. Yep. Oh my god. All right, um, and then we found the little um, uh, how the, it was like a pool temple thing. Yes, uh, and yeah. they made a terrible decision with straight to the pool of water. Like, yeah, I don't know why you jumped. Up, no remorse, like, just immediately oh, no, 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 yeet no, no, no. and dropped in. The rest of us just like, huh? Oh, what are this strange pool? And then Faye runs by all of us and jumps in. Yep. Faye has the skill to play. I started making. In William's castle, where she jumps into water like a crazy lunatic, just just impulse. Hmm. So when I saw the mysterious pool, of water, I'm like, wait, in character, I have to do it. Out of character, I don't want to do, but it would go hmm. against that flaw. I'm like, well, yeah, here goes nothing. And it changed you into a tiefling. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. How would you explain it to your parents? It will be interesting. <laughs> Oh god. Right. And, uh, then yeah. we fought some, uh, what was it, treants? So yeah. The treants were very mad at Faye for jumping in the pool, and therefore we had to burn uh... them to the ground. So I did treants, okay, I think you I mean splinters. That, I'm <laughs> sorry, I got you guys in trouble. <laughs> I didn't realize that part. <laughs> but it's too self Splinters and ash. Like craziness, um, like but then we uh, ended up going down uh, like a ladder thing into yep. like, I assume and, it was uh, underground shell 
Yeah, it was underground. Okay. And uh, Iko caught a glimpse of spooky lady with antlers. Mm -hmm. um, and so we went down, and then there was like a staircase temple thing, uh, and at the top was a uh, crystal thing. Um, but we had to, or well, Fang Fit snuck past the golem. After he explicitly promised us not to go sneaking off on her own or touch the thing yeah. before we got to inspect it. She didn't yep. promise. Yes, she, she did. did. Yeah, no, she, she did, did actually. No, she didn't. Yeah, she did. I definitely did not say I promise. <laughs> if you're asking, you promise something, and then you agree. It's a promise. I don't remember anyone saying promise. I mean, the video will confirm. I mean, I haven't edited it yet, find, so... We will find out. <laughs> we'll find out eventually. If, if, if we did say promise, just flash reds in idiot. If, uh, if uh, not, then just flash a uh, sexy red right there. <laughs> I don't even have the sexy red image anymore. Well, don't worry, we can resend you. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's on the Discord, so it's uh, very easy to do so. Anyway, um... Uh, Fang Fit snuck past and broke her patron out. Uh, With the, of the help crystal. of your uh, drow friend? I mean, you didn't friend. even damage it. <laughs> I don't care if I damaged it. Nobody would have gotten involved if it wasn't for me. <laughs> um, I don't have fire spells. She's, she's trying to have an excuse. excuse. I mean, <laughs> she, she's passed me as draws. <laughs> um... And then, uh, so yeah, we bro broke, uh, Aelin out. Uh, oh my god, we know. And, I mean, I don't know, she didn't seem super happy with Fane Fates, but also not, like, angry. But then Aiko decided to sell her, sell Aiko's soul in order to oh. gain control of Fang Fitz's powers or something? Um, but, I feel it's just but, stolen her soul for something else now. But, uh, with uh, my friendly, you know, good, cool, sexy, amazing, <laughs> handsome DM here, who I am not buttering up in any way whatsoever at all, is like so kind enough to allow me to <laughs> reinstate the deal, so now I can, so now, instead of selling my soul for Ben fixes powers, I get something a little more me. Wait, what? Oh? They, they renegotiated the gift. Or the, um, yeah. the deal. Oh, so what? you didn't get my powers. Nope. No. Okay, okay. Right. We're retconning that. Retconning? But I yeah, thought of it. It's been retconned. It's okay. been retconned, but Ico <laughs> thought of it. This is the, um, force things we were homebrewing. Oh, yeah. okay. Ah! So what, what is this? Alright, so pretty much is with the abilities that Iko chose is you have your Force Save DC which your Force Ability modifier is going to be your Charisma, Intelligence, or Wisdom. You choose when you pick it, but you can't change it afterwards. Then uh, Iko chose the Force Lift option, which is an Invisible Mage Hand. That now has a Curating Capacity of 10 times the force ability score. Mind trick for suggestion. And then also. <laughs> don't know how to pronounce the last one, female. Premonition. Yeah. Premonition. Premonition. Yeah. That's her cast deviation spell once per day. I went down a specific route for premonition. So, yeah. Okay. All right. Well, that that, that makes Fane Fitz a little bit happier. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, Fane Fitz doesn't know about that, but still. Yeah, but it will cause less problems. Yeah, it will cause a lot less problems. <laughs> yeah. But a lot more cool <laughs> shit. <laughs> it's like, why am I doing this for Fane Fitz alone? I want something a little more me. <laughs> something for me. So, Aiko is now a Jedi? <laughs> I am about to... Half my goal all along was to be a Jedi. No. Uh, I, 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 in other words, I'm going to... Jedi. <laughs> the competition. No! 
Oh. Yeah, now, now you're definitely a Jedi. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yep. Then you had the confrontation of Aelin and Iris. Uh -huh. That happened They just kind of stared at each other. Yeah. And communicated through a sign language, so. Uh huh. Mr. Man, Drew Chill, has anyone ever told you, told you that your voice sounds magnificent today? Why are you bothering people up? I just know! <laughs> so, as you can it's see, so you cringy to me! Alright, everyone, as you can see here, I am going to cast combustion on Ico. <laughs> 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 yes, Thankfully, please. it has a con save. The best con save. Not if I do it save. first. Oh, yeah? yeah? Too bad I'm already attacking Geico with maximum. No! Um, but, anyways, yeah, yeah we. Uh, yeah. Didn't we leave that area? Yeah, then you guys just we got out there. And we're back in the forest. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alright. Unless you guys want to quickly run back now. into there for some reason. <laughs> Iko knows things now, uh, after, like, doing that deal with Aelin, and now has some explaining to do to some members of the party who rolled, uh, really good on their insight. Yeah, you do. Helena expects an explanation. Oh? Yeah. Oh, yeah, so he didn't actually tell rolled so. good on their insight? Uh, I have no Definitely idea. Definitely not me! Uh, I don't remember me rolling good. So. Hold on. I think I was oblivious, like normal. Oh, so are we not having Claire today? No, no Claire's just running late. Late. Uh, Oh yeah, we have to roll, go past like the 11, not 20s I rolled earlier. <laughs> <laughs> not to mention... I'm pretty sure I saw through your lie and Pip-wise didn't know what the conversation was going on but knew that you were lying or something. Yeah. Yeah. And that might have been Pip someone else. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking. Myers. It's uh, Tipthy. Tipthy uh, had the same role as Helena. Yeah, that that was the other one. So, yeah, I only need to explain to Tipthy and Helena. Hmm. As for Fenfix, just didn't roll high enough on oh, nope. Yep, got it. It was Helena, Tipthy, and Pipwise. But Pipwise, but Pipwise wasn't. Like, See, was... I called it. Yeah. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> I think this is yep. the start of a new and new fresh and long friendship. <laughs> All right. So we last left off. You guys were leaving the temple. So what do you want to do now? Uh-huh. golf temple. The Jedi well, temple. We're going to the border where Aelin pointed us. Yeah. Uh, because we, want, we need to get through the border. Should we start disguising ourselves Wait, why are we going now? through the border again? Just the... Um, because there's like this whole war that you all started that we're gonna go fix now. <laughs> Actually, Jack's gonna end up meeting you there probably. Wait, what do you mean by you all? Sad drow noises. You all as a group, but mostly you, pointing at Faint Fix. What did I do? <laughs> Orange. <laughs> But that was already taken care of. That war finished. This is a new war. Mm. No, 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 no. The, the, this war is because of Betty Bishy. <laughs> yeah, so blame Donald. Oh, wait. He's dead. He's dead! <laughs> <laughs> Whatever is started. I, I don't know. We have to clean up the mess left by a dead person. Great. <laughs> the duel was supposed to, to prevent a war, but it obviously hasn't. Quest to find Keebler Elves. Begin! <laughs> Either way, Northon's under siege, and we could do something to help them. I suppose. But do we have to? Yes. Why? I'm all for helping them. <laughs> well, Fane Fix, maybe you would prefer to stay here in the middle of the forest and search for gnomes the rest of your days. 
No, there doesn't really seem to be any gnomes here. Real ones, at least. Wow. <laughs> Paul Stevens isn't a real gnome? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Who? Paul Stevens, the guy you met? Oh. I don't even remember him. <laughs> wow. Penguins <laughs> is, is just gnome. gonna be like, yeah, I don't really count him as a gnome. <laughs> the one gnome doesn't count. Penguins can't be choosers here. <laughs> <coughs> well, Fanfix, come or stay, it doesn't matter to me. I mean, fast. I guess I'll tag along. Got nothing better to do. Just don't cause any more trouble for us. That's mi my middle name, though. <laughs> Roll insight on that. I don't think With it's a capital T. Real name. <laughs> <laughs> well, right, you're never yeah. city. Oh wait. Roll insight. Roll insight on that. If that's your real name. Oh. <laughs> 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 I mean, you can. <laughs> we all know it's sarcastic. Yeah. Do we? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just messing around. I mean, I guess we don't actually know Fenfix's real name, or middle name. <laughs> I don't know her actual middle name, but it's not trouble. Okay. <laughs> Burn. I didn't know I had to come up with her middle name. <laughs> and you can't come up with one on the spot just now? No, well, I want to make sure it's something good. <laughs> and something I won't regret later, so give me a while. Yeah, the best part is regretting it later. <laughs> yeah. Fed fix fantastical LC. Alright, so are you guys heading out? I'm packing up the cart. Fair enough. Kaz is already inside tinkering with stuff. Of course she is. Alright, anything else yep. you guys doing while you're here? Uh, probably not. I don't really think there's anything else for us to do. Nope. No one wanted to do anything else I'm here. looking for Keebler Elves. <laughs> Keebler <Yeah>. Elves? <laughs> yeah. I mean... You mean, I... basically gnomes? Wait, 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 wait. Shouldn't I disguise That's now? Or will I have time to disguise later? Faye, we'll be traveling through the woods for days. I think yeah. you'll have some time before okay, we get to the border. Okay, okay, uh, uh, Alright, just double checking. You're looking for Keebler elves. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to look around the forest and see whatever I find in the forest of coincidence. Who knows? Maybe another coincidence might happen. <laughs> Keebler elves, got it. Look at DD chat! Oh yeah, that's a Keebler elf. <laughs> that is definitely a Keebler elf, so uh, looks like you're looking yeah. for that. <laughs> Alright. So then as you guys are traveling a little bit through the forest, there is a little bit of like, a mini town up ahead. Oh. You guys want to go check that out? Uh, yes. Alright. Sure. Alright, so you enter this little town. Yeah. It's very quiet, quaint, not much really going on. It's not anywhere near the town, like cities you've been in. This is like uh -huh. a small, small village town. Not even be, on like, the map. Not even on the map. Yeah, there's like five buildings in this town. Oh. How quaint. Yep. Uh, uh, and, what time and, of day is it? Like, would this be a good place to um, stop? Yeah, if you want to stop here for the night, you can. Is, Probably is there one or two like, hours till. Is there anyone like walking around or anything? Um, like, can we see around, there's, there's a few people walking around. There's also some elves walking around carrying some bread and pastries. Uh, can Jack teleport in like right now? <laughs> You're with us. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, shit. My cool entrance. Yeah, these elves just walk inside a tree of all the pastries and everything, and as you can look, 
you can see like there's a little bit of smoke rising from the tree. It doesn't look like fire or anything, just some soft Wait, smoke. You, you mean literally this <laughs> is Keebler elves? <laughs> I mean, I already had a plan for otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what they look like when I post them in D and D chat now, because that's what Alpha said. So that's what they look like now. <laughs> yeah, I mean that—that's a Keebler elf. Like, yep, <laughs> that is what they are. <laughs> uh, I guess we go knock on the door to this tree, or Fankins right. does at least. Yes, yes, who is it? Hello! No, you must... Uh... Missed opportunity, Glishel! That could have been a knock- Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh, hello. Uh, uh, I'm Detective Banquet, Celsi. Uh... Ah, well, nice to meet ya. We're just mm -hmm. passing through. Uh... Trying oh. to figure out where we are. Oh, you see, you're just in the middle of the forest. Where are you trying to head to? Uh, north. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be easy. You're just gonna keep going that direction you're currently going. <laughs> okay. What well, what is this place? It's just a little little village town out here. We got our bakery and a tree. It's all going good here. Oh, the bakery. Why, yes. Only the finest pastries are served here. Mmm. <laughs> you, you see Fainfit's, like, lick her lips. <laughs> so, Ika's gonna come up behind Penfix and whisper in uh, Penfix's ear, You know, we could, you know, mess with the party a little bit and, you know, get ourselves some chocolate chip cookies, but uh, ad uh, attempt to hand out cookies to the rest of the party, but they're secretly raisin cookies. Oh. No! <laughs> no! The cookie thing actually came to him! No! Well, we do uh, have uh, both those cookies if you like. And I was like, the, just imagining, like, Frankfurt is all the way down to the ground, so <laughs> I guess having to, like, bend way over to whisper in Frankfurt to see it. I guess yeah, just, just, like, down. <laughs> just, like, just on one knee, still kneeling down. You know. Yeah. Let's <laughs> do this. <laughs> uh, and Frankfurt is gonna turn right to the elf and be like, uh, any chance we could, uh, you know, buy some cookies? Oh yes, we can definitely do that here for ya. Oh. How many are you looking for? Uh how much do we have in the party? <laughs> uh there's how many of us? Well, if you're counting cats, there's it. nine. Okay, so we need seven well, raisin cookies and two chocolate. William chip. doesn't count because he's in a coma. So there's eight. We need a few dozen. <laughs> <laughs> that works too. Alright, oh, that's not gonna be a problem. Uh, cool. I need some for How many elites would you like? Uh, Just do one dozen ways and one dozen chocolate. Come on, don't be easy that way. Sure, let's just do that. <laughs> no, no, to be evil, give both a chocolate and a raisin to every party member. They just don't know which raisin. <laughs> <laughs> there are two cookies! <laughs> <laughs> One of the cookies is the raisin. <laughs> All right. So then, as they go back inside, they're gonna gently wrap up and put them in like nice little gift baskets for you to have the cookies in. <laughs> <laughs> I love this so much. All right. All together, that's just gonna be one gold coin. Oh, okay. I just hand them a gold coin. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, there we go. All right, well, thank you very much. You have a good rest of your day. And they're going to hand you the two baskets. Hmm. All right, uh, I guess, I guess before, we... like, we, me and Fenfix join the rest of the party, we're just mm -hmm. going to, like... <laughs> ah, shoot, how, how will you sort, sort out these cookies? Although they did not tell you which one was which. <laughs> 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 And I already have it written down which basket's which. Basket one, uh, basket two. The pranksters were pranked. No, 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 no. You do my method. Give one cookie from each bag to each party member. All right, Fenfix, I need your investigation skills. Oh. <laughs> Fenfix pulls out her magnifying glass to inspect these cookies. <laughs> which gives me advantage on that. All right. 
Uh, have you roll investigation? Like... You have. Oh my control. god! <laughs> they, they, no, cookies are just so well made. You honestly can't <laughs> tell the difference right now between the two types. Beautiful. But they are looking very delicious right now and very mm. warm in your hands. So you're holding the basket. You can feel the warm radiating from the cookie still. Okay, who's gonna actually? Yeah, I, I go has it. Yeah, I go. You haven't figured it out either. Uh, Fang Fitz is, uh, uh, is gonna look at Aiko and be like, Alright, you try one, I'll try one from the other one. Alright. <laughs> Alright, who, who's eating which basket? Uh, okay, Do we, I'm just gonna roll a 1d2, I guess. Okay. Just see which basket, okay. Uh, I guess I'm taking from basket 1. <laughs> Alright! <laughs> then Fang Fitz taking from basket 2, okay. Yeah. Hold on, the question is, is Fenfix going to let Aiko eat her But, 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 be before we do, uh -huh. those characters would not like oatmeal raisin. Sorry, what? What? Um, I don't, I don't know. Think I most. I don't know. Oatmeal, 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 what? Raisin? Yeah, oatmeal raisin. Yeah, which one, oatmeal, which okay. people don't like oatmeal cookies, which I one mean, do? I, I think... feel like Aiko might? I don't know. Like, she's lived on the streets. Yeah, same with Fame Fix. I feel like <laughs> I mean, a cookie is a cookie. Yeah. yeah. Fame would probably Especially like... in sort of a fantasy setting. A cookie is a cookie. <laughs> yeah. True. That's, that's true. All right. So then, as you, are you both going to eat at the same time? I feel like yeah. since we both have roguish backgrounds, we might like it, but once we like, 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 oh, oh, like, oh, like oh, Yeah, so, well, uh, like, once we try the chocolate chip, we'll be like, ooh, that one's so much better. So, <laughs> Fame Fix. Uh-huh. It's gonna bite into the cookie. It's chocolate. It tastes very sweet, but then you feel the chocolate rush in your mouth. Ah. Uh. <laughs> it's amazingly good. You just uh, see Fenfix's eyes light up. <laughs> yeah. As I go. Did you take a bite in? Yeah, this one's definitely the prank cookies. <laughs> the prank cookies? What? The, the prank cookies. The this still no raisin. Yep, that's oatmeal. <laughs> if I was the TM, I would have given Ico one necrotic damage. <laughs> no! <laughs> no. Oatmeal cookies don't hurt you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Healthy foods hurt. <laughs> oh no. Um, opposite of that. <laughs> Remember, kids, don't eat your greens. Uh, uh, no! Although, <laughs> uh, after both of you have eaten the cookie, you are under the blessed spell for one minute. Ah. Yeah. That's amazing. They want all the blessed. cookies. She wants all the cookies. We've been blessed That's by Keebler Elves. And their secret recipe. Their secret blessing recipe. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Alright, so you guys know which is which? <laughs> Alright. I guess uh, Fenfix and I return to the party yeah. with magical cookies. <laughs> <laughs> As, um, as you're returning, mm -hmm. I'm sending Aiko a message. Mm -hmm. Reminding you that you still need to explain yourself. Explain <laughs> uh, And your, de your deal with Aelin. Uh, can reply in a whisper only you can... Here's the message. Can reply in a whisper only you can hear. Okay. Is there, like, a size limit to how, what I can reply with? You got six seconds. Yeah. Uh, so maybe, like, yes. ten or two words. Yes, yes, I'll explain uh, as soon as, you know, we're away from uh, everyone else. Don't wait too long. <laughs> In due time, due time. <laughs> uh, I guess we get back in the cart. All right, I'm so as they get back in the cart, you all can smell. Oh, that they smells good. Something. Yeah. Like, it's already smelling really good in the cart <laughs> as soon as they enter. You bought bakery treats? I smell whipping right No. <laughs> Perhaps. I, I, I smell But here, whipping. have a cookie. <laughs> Are you offering me a cookie? Yeah. I'm taking a cookie. Which one did you offer? Uh, I think Frankfurt is probably carrying the chocolate ones. Uh, I'm eating the cookie. 
All right. So as you it's find delicious. the cookie, this is this is probably the best cookie you've ever had. <laughs> oh my god! I mean, sure, sure you've probably had some like pastries before in the back of the cast, but this is like the best cookie you've ever tasted ever. <laughs> I guess Iko starts handing out cookies to the party. <laughs> I can imagine, like, I was setting up my apparatus to, like, brew something as we were traveling, and, and <laughs> but then the cookies came, and now I'm just, like, sitting on the floor munching on a cookie. Yay, cookies! <laughs> Alright, so then Iko's handing you the rest of, the, rest of you cookies. Okay. Yep. <laughs> so that was just the crappy cookies. Yes. So, so <laughs> as, as you all, as you all see... Helena, just stop what she's doing. Completely focused on eating the cookie. <laughs> Are y'all taking a bite of yours? Uh, Jack's cracking open his. <laughs> the bait. <laughs> the bait is real. <laughs> Alright, you crack open your cookie and it looks like normal cookie. It, okay, which one gets cookie. which cookie? No what, Marson? I did this is not a good weapon at all. It's no. not even stale. You're it's supposed to eat it. It's delicious. <laughs> you haven't realized I haven't eaten for the last 14 weeks. Well, if you're not going to eat it, I will. <laughs> well, take it. I mean, it's never enough, but it's right. working out better than I expected. <laughs> <laughs> right, I knew so giving one, like, one chocolate chip to someone <laughs> that entice everyone to have uh, the right. not so good ones. Having their cookies then? Now, the real question is. Who in the party actually doesn't like them? Yeah. I mean, I, I don't think anyone on. doesn't like, but there is a difference in like, ooh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's just the surprise, of course. Yeah. <laughs> the chocolate chip ones are so much better. <laughs> yeah. All right. So you rest you eating your cookies then? Y yes or no? Anyone there? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Is dog still here? Yeah. Okay. Are you eating your <laughs> cookie? Quiet. Okay, I'm gonna give yes. half back to Helena. I'll eat that half. Pip, you I... eating your cookie? Mm -hmm. Thankfully, Pip. 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 Oh, this cookie is different. Are you consuming the cookie, Jog? I don't know. <laughs> Are you alive, Jog? Yeah. Where is Pip think... tonight? Uh, he's, he's right there. But go with yes, he's having a cookie. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's so much different when you know it's a prank. <laughs> so, so as the rest of you are eating the cookie, yeah, they're, they're pretty good, but they're definitely not on the same level of the one that Helena apparently had there. Can, can, can I attempt to taste the actual ingredients of the cookie? What? <laughs> what? what? You'd have to eat the cookie to do that. Yeah. <laughs> this already. I, t I only gave half to Helena. I ate the other half. Okay. Yeah, th this one definitely doesn't taste the same as, well, doesn't taste nearly as good as it looked when Helena had her first cookie. <laughs> the, the taste you experience is not near the taste you saw <laughs> Helena <experience>. Yeah. <laughs> the experience is not the same as you saw. <laughs> my temporal investigation on my mouth. On your... No. Why? Damn it. I cannot recall this flavor. Alright. Yep. Cass is just gonna be like, has the cookie in her mouth and she's slowly eating it as she's working. <laughs> not focused at all on the cookie. <laughs> not like, it's just Helena. Yeah, no, no, not paying attention to the cookie taste, just like, oh yes, it's sweet. As she's just working on sound waves. Like, ah oh, yes, munchies. Mm, yep. It's snack time. Nap time? Wait, why is it Snack time. Why is there 10 seconds or something? Actually, Alright, you guys doing anything else for you here, or? We oh, have to else. take some of these cookies with us. I mean, we got more. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but the good ones run out, we'll eat fanfics. What? <laughs> 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 Did you say you were gonna eat me? Oh, oh, I'm mm. You do look kind of tasty. Yeah, thank you. Wait. 
<laughs> Frank is just gonna look at this halfling <laughs> and be like, "What really? is your problem? <laughs> Who in their right mind would want want to eat a gnome?" Exactly. I mean, sure, we I taste know. good, but. <laughs> what? I, I mean, know, yeah, that's, that's, that's what I'm saying. I, I'm not saying I'd want to eat you. I'm just saying you do look kind of tasty. How would okay, think that's no bad? Wait, what? How would think that snow gnomes taste good? <laughs> <I mean, laughs> she doesn't actually, but it's kind of making a joke. <laughs> That, hell, she hasn't seen the number gnome, so she, how the hell would she know what a gnome tastes like? <laughs> she might have taken a bite out of herself at some point. Oh my god! <laughs> I mean, I guess <laughs> she could have. Suppose, although yeah. she's not really missing any chunks of her body. Well, who said it was like was. taking a, a bite out of like a chunk? It'd been like a lick of the wrist. But uh, I mean, I suppose. All right. <laughs> it's not exactly the same thing. <laughs> yeah, it's close enough. Alright, so you guys are moving on then? Yeah. Alright. Yeah. So then, as you guys move on, it takes you about a few days. How many yeah, days? Here. This will take you about three days, but on the... This night here... Mm -hmm. Who's taking watch? Hold on, I want to brew a potion first. I mean, Fang Fates always sleeps. <laughs> I mean, I feel like I should take watch, but I want to, uh, I, for a, a moment in this night, I want to wake up uh, Fenfix to have a little chat. Oh. Well, all right. Uh, what, what is it? But hold, hold on, hold on. First, who's taking watch? Yeah, yeah, Jack, like usual. Uh, because okay, Jack's watch. taking watch. So then it's going to be Jack and Aiko. Yep. Okay, I'll have you both roll perception real quick. Um, let me see. Let me read this before I do that. Uh... I mean, can I can I have like pulled Iko aside somewhere earlier on in the three days? Yeah, Jesus. yeah, yeah. You'll have time. How many people are pulling you back? Okay. Um, Iko owes me explanation. Yep. Yeah. So, first, we will do the... Um, actually, which one of the conversations do you want to have first? The Ico... The Ico Helena Probably or the Ico... Probably the Helena first? one. Okay. Do the Ico Helena one first, then. Ah! So, what was your real deal? Oh, right, that. Uh... Well, uh, I may have made a deal with, uh, Aelin here for, uh, a little, uh, help in, uh, well, uh, stopping this war. Oh? J well, let me just, uh, and then, uh, like, is there, like, a quick, uh, like, uh, everyone's sleeping at this point, right? Well, I Probably, think maybe. you guys are pulled aside. Yeah. Jack's yeah. probably somewhere else when this is going on. Okay, so like I I'm assuming there's like uh, quit like uh, alchemist equipment or something to the side, like weird instruments. I mean, if you guys want to have this conversation by the cart, you can. Well, I just want to know: Will anyone see this? Possibly. Hmm. So, uh, Aiko's going to subtly, like, lift up, uh, and have, make a few of our, uh, Helena's instruments float. <laughs> uh... Cool? I'm not sure how this helps us, though. <laughs> oh, it, it needs to be a secret. It won't be a secret for long, I assure you. What did you promise her? Why do you care? There's no way she gave this to you for free. <sighs> That's not important. I made a deal to give us, give us a fighting chance to save this continent from war. What more do you want from me? Um, a little trust would be nice. If we're, you know, 
we are fighting on the same side. I trust you. After all, I have I haven't told you a lie ever since we've met. But hell, I even I, hell, I even tore out my soul and admitted that I was a, the petty thief. Although that's not really much. I mean, I'm going to be honest. I thought of making a deal to you know gain complete and total control over that gnome's powers. R thought of it. <laughs> and you didn't. Not, that feels a bit too controlling. I trust the gnome has a good side. <laughs> <laughs> what? Not anybody's born evil. Uh, born evil, no. Uh, the comments burn down cities, have no remorse. Yes. C can I? I, I, I mean, I, I'm just curious. It would. When was this? Was this just like sometime during the day while we're traveling? This was or? far away from Fenfix. I okay. feel like this would be um like at night when I was taking my watch. Okay, all right. I was gonna be like, oh, but maybe Fenfix get over here just and be like, wait, they don't think I'm evil. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, I have a feeling continue. we can turn this gnome around. Plus, I do have. Uh, I do have some... <laughs> it's complicated. Look, you know that dead druid back at the dragon cave? I remember. I respect her wishes, and she wanted to protect Finpix. Don't know how uh, they came into contact in the first place, but I just want to respect her wishes. Could you I... understand that? I guess. She's your responsibility. <laughs> She's our responsibility as far as we're concerned. We gotta make sure she keeps out of trouble. I'm not confident that I can uh, keep her under check all on my own. Okay. After all, you did just see how uh, the little sneaky rat uh, snuck past us uh, when we were encountering <laughs> that red crystal thing. Yeah. I do remember that. I'm not sure how we're supposed to keep up with her, though. Yeah, but, uh... Yeah, that's pretty much the deal that, uh, I made. <laughs> okay, I feel like that's all you wanted to talk about. <laughs> yeah. Sweet. <laughs> I got away with not, not telling uh, what I offered. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's going to be important later. Mm -hmm. That's going to bite me in the ass. What did you offer again? My soul. Okay, yeah. Just making sure it wasn't something different. No, I mean, what else would she offer? Alright, so are we doing the Fenfix conversation uh, yeah. now? Yeah. Hey, Fenfix. Yeah. Come on, come with me for a bit. Uh, sure. There's just something I want to talk to with you about. All right, Finn Fitz, uh follows you. Okay, so uh, this like wagon or something that we're riding on, like, mm -hmm. does it have like a roof to like sit on top of and look at the stars or something? Um, I would what? recommend not sitting on the roof because it's just that hood cover, so. It's okay. basically just like something to keep the leaves out of our stuff. Yeah. Okay, maybe something else to change the setting, like maybe sitting on the side of it, looking outside. Alright. So, Fenfix, uh, look, I know you don't trust me, but mm -hmm. please understand that the party clearly doesn't trust you at all either. I mean, yeah. I can tell. You know, after they beat the crap out of me and y'all were about to leave me for dead. Yes, I hopefully we're long past that now. But, uh, look, I know how important Miriamin was to you. And I don't think I could ever compare to what Mar you and Mariamen had, but I would just wish you'd at least give me a chance. Okay. 
Yeah, uh, I feel like I should tell you something. No. Uh, about Aelin, right? Yeah. I made a deal with her. What kind of deal? I, uh, well, I sold my soul. Oh, God! I didn't even go that far. <laughs> I sold my soul for a power that might help us, you know, undo all this. As I use my, the force lift to pick up uh, Fen Fix. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> Just like way less. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. Why? Hold on a minute, Jack. Would definitely be able to fucking see a flying gnome. No, I'm only, I'm only lifting you like. Yeah. Uh, I'm only lifting Fenfix like uh, a foot off the ground. <laughs> Not even as tall as a person. Yeah. 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 yeah all right. I can live against that. Whoa. I'm just. I'm just playfully doing it. Pretty cool, right? Yeah. It's but neat. uh. I may have learned something uh, with my private talk with Aelin that I feel like you should know. You oh. deserve to know because no one should keep secrets about their family heritage, whether oh! hated or not. <laughs> you know your parents. Um, I found out the truth about your parents from Aelin. Really? In the time we had. They fucked. They wanted power, and they were going to sacrifice you for it. Oh, I guess that made sense. But Aelin decided to kill your parents, and instead give that power to you. I see. That's why I didn't have to sell my soul. Cause she got two souls out of it already. Okay. <laughs> I mean, your parents sound like awful people, but aren't you at least, like, worried that what Aelin might do? No. I, I mean, Aelin certainly doesn't sound trustworthy. You just sold your soul to her. Like well... <laughs> <laughs> I did sell my soul to her, and I'm assure you I might regret that later. But you see, there's a reason I sold my soul. Oh. Fanfix, I might not have much left time in this world. You see, I sold my soul because shadows cannot live without the things that cast them. That sounds deep. As much as I hate to admit <laughs> <laughs> as much as I hate to admit it, now that Elnor is gone, I got nothing now. Oh, um. <laughs> <laughs> About that. <laughs> hmm? Uh, Elnor isn't, you know, dead, like, D E A D. She's. <laughs> <laughs> She's more of just like D E D. <laughs> D E D. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> but not really. <laughs> so dead or dead? <laughs> well, dead, like with quotation marks. <laughs> so you're telling me I just sold my soul for nothing. I mean, you got these cool powers, right? Does that count for I, something? Ah, uh, <laughs> Aiko's just gonna like put her hands to her head and just like try not to scream and wake everyone else up, <laughs> and just Ray! like charges back into the uh, mobile lab. Does someone need Jack off in Shorn's therapy? I mean, I. Like, having an like, internal there. mental breakdown. I feel like that might wake other people up. <laughs> it would definitely get Jack's attention, at least. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck's 
sequel is out now. <laughs> <laughs> Will it wake people up? I don't think so. Mm. I go, what the fuck is no. going on? <laughs> okay. Why didn't you tell me sooner? <laughs> Wait, are you still talking the fame fits or? No, I'm just I, I'm oh, talking okay. to myself. <laughs> Mental breakdown. Uh -huh. Yeah. I'll just pull out my psychic inquisition real quick. <laughs> oh. oh, psychic powers, uh, let's go. See. What can I um, temporarily block out the memory of accidentally selling your soul? No! I feel like. <laughs> I feel like Aiko's like thoughts are like try not to kill the gnome. Aiko, <laughs> <laughs> is everything alright? Well, no, not really. You're screaming like a lunatic, but still. I'm not actually screaming. I'm just like inter. It's like inter. Like hyperventilating. <laughs> yeah. Are you screaming. Do you think the mystic can't tell if you're <laughs> screaming? Uh, I you can't read mine twenty four seven, can yeah. you? No, no, but, but it's the goddamn mind mage. He but, should be able to tell these signs. I'm making I, a joke. I, I mean, you can at least tell yeah, that he... probably Iko's dealing with some shit. <laughs> yeah. But I can't tell exactly what she's dealing with. I just know she's dealing with that shit. <laughs> yeah. Alright, Iko, what the fuck is going on? Nothing. <laughs> Why do you care? You know, I'll be honest. I don't fucking know. <laughs> to all of you, I'm just the would-be chosen one. Yeah, and to... I'm a has-been. Mm -hmm. And to everyone else, I'm a leech. Keep talking. <laughs> <laughs> Jack's like, yeah, you don't have it that bad. <laughs> As much as I don't want to now. Jack, mm -hmm. do me a favor. Mm -hmm. Oh? If I ever do die, mm -hmm. I want you to take all of my coin-worthy valuables. It all goes to you. Gold, gems, all of it. Why him? You better not For a Jack Golf insurance plan for the entire party. Oh. Yeah, um... Hmm. <laughs> and if you let me down, I assure you, I will haunt you from days and eternity to come. So you don't have your soul? <laughs> yeah, but he doesn't, he doesn't know, know that. that. He doesn't yeah. know that. Yeah. He doesn't know that. He doesn't know what you <laughs> if I was any other irrational person, I would take that deal because they wouldn't believe in ghosts. However, I clearly <laughs> remember I watched someone die thanks to a fucking ghost at one point. <laughs> so I will proudly not take this because I know what I'm fucking with here. <laughs> so you're taking it or not taking it? He's not. No. Well, also, what do you think I even do with all this money anyways? Nothing. You hoard it. Yes. I mean, not here, but yes. <laughs> <laughs> or you spend it like pain fits. I'm asking for your mere protection against the party. If I'm there, I'm there. <laughs> oh, I get it, because he's not there for half no, the I mean, session. Tom, Tom, not the middle finger, not the middle finger. No. <laughs> <laughs> I I go just takes her cloak of protection and puts it over her head. Just leave me alone. Do you need therapy? <laughs> what? I don't think we know that. Uh, under the cloak of protection, you hear the click of a gun. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> I said, leave me alone. Oh. Oh, it's pointed at Jack. Okay. Yeah. Realize that? It can't be that. Come on, Nigo. I can't really risk death since I sold my soul. 
I go, come on, it's fine. Just tell me what the hell is wrong, because I think, just think, there's a gun currently pointed at my head right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is great! You wouldn't be wrong about that. Don't make me wake up this entire cabin, or wherever the heck this is. Wagon, horse, cart, cart, thing, Wagon, bear. Wagon, cart, horse, thing. Cart, yeah, thing, bear, yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh... Mobile base. <laughs> That's a pretty small mobile base. Yeah. Okay, hold on, I uh, internet came back, what do you say, Alpha? Don't make me wake up this entire freaking mobile lab. Just take it! Lincoln, <laughs> come on, don't make me... Like... Who is he? Your mic is cutting out badly. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. I couldn't even understand what you were trying to say. Still, I don't know what yeah, you're saying. Um, yeah. Can you speak up just a little I'm bit? I'm trying to. You're very out. quiet. I know, I'm good. Ico, don't make me use my psychic mind powers on you. That requires brain cells. <laughs> I lift open the uh, cloak of protection to show my face and. The gun? <laughs> and no? the gun? Yeah, and the gun. <laughs> Probably has glowing red eyes. <laughs> um, actually, since Jack doesn't have dark vision, what should make it with advantage? <laughs> um, would it be with advantage since he couldn't really even see her? Yeah, yeah. How does that work? All right. Work? Well, it's a sixteen. I can't the moon likes just right. <laughs> <laughs> did Did you pay off a moon god? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, technically, there's a drow, yes? <laughs> yeah. You know what? I don't want to suffer, suffer asteroid damage right now. I'll be off. <laughs> Finally, you took the hand. <laughs> uh, and despite what, uh, how Fane Fates acted when, uh, uh, Aiko was telling her about her parents. Fane Fitz is also kind of sitting, like, somewhere outside the cart, just kind of crying a little bit. About which part? Her parents and stuff. Her parents, uh, betraying her or dying? Both. Okay, Echo tells Fenfix know. immediately about parents. Uh, Fenfix <laughs> finds out that Eleanor's still alive, decides to, uh, <laughs> uh concealed for a possible prank earlier. <laughs> prank gone too far! <laughs> no, Boy, who back. didn't see this coming? <laughs> yep. <laughs> but who you also kind of broke Fane Fitz as well, so... <laughs> yeah. You, I think we broke each other. <laughs> yeah. Shot through the heart! <laughs> but yeah, she had just kind of played it off when she was talking with you. This is like, uh, okay. Um, Shadows cannot live. So the next the day. day. Yeah, next yeah. day. Yeah, now until the next day. Fane Fitz is I like. I have more health potions. <laughs> but, well, like when y'all wake up, Fane Fitz is like curled up outside, like next to a tree, oh. where she fell asleep. Uh, <laughs> I kind of like glance at Aiko like, uh, are you okay? Aiko says nothing. <laughs> are you okay? When am I ever okay? <laughs> so that's a no. I'm gonna go Don't. pick up the gnome, I guess? <laughs> <laughs> just pick her up. <laughs> <laughs> you do that. Just pick Fix up and put her on the cart so we can go. Fix <laughs> <laughs> just uh, stays asleep. <laughs> All right. 
So then as you guys travel for a few hours, uh -huh. you get to here. Guys, on the cart. Look at that! Oh, there's a cart. <laughs> Ta-da! There's a cart now. Oh wait, I should you be know, back at I rent, claim though. all of this space for my lab. <laughs> okay, you know, you're sharing God. some of that with Kaz. You're sharing some of that with Kaz. Fine. <laughs> and Daiko. No, this is my lab space. You're you are not a lab person. Get out. Uh, of I'm not your drug <laughs> monkey. Oh, uh, yeah, we don't have any drugs for you. Damn. <laughs> Y'all could sit up front on the bench. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you can fit three people on that bench. I was just going to sit there and meditate using her new abilities. All right. Cool. Hmm. Are you using that ability? Yes. All right. We're, we're missing question something. Who are we missing? Jog. Oh, did I forget the puppy? Oh, we're missing, we're missing Faye. Yeah, we're missing Faye. Yeah, we're missing Faye. That's who we're missing. Go sit up front. Okay, okay. Let me... I need to zoom into He's the back. Like, oh, and Claire's still not here. <laughs> That's who the other person was. I was like, who are we missing? I want to look at the lab. <laughs> you I mean, you, you, you can see the lab. Like. You can yeah. see it from over there. <laughs> yeah, Claire missed some heart to heart and you cookies. Know what? Uh -huh. you, you yeah. that, that should be the title of the episode, Heart okay. to Heart and Cookies. Mm -hmm. You know that thing where heart they put cookies. their palms and face up against the glass? That's Faye right now, just staring to the lab. Just face squishing against the glass with her hands. I don't think there's glass. glass. It's... There's no glass. No. Yeah. <laughs> this is really just a wagon that you put on the table here. Yeah. That's it. I, I feel like I go in that whole conversation, it's like, I'm going to befriend the gnome. Uh, the gnome. Uh, so, about Eleanor. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> Completely so throws off the whole plan. <laughs> I guess <just> plan. <laughs> curveball that was not expected. <laughs> All the curveballs were thrown in the first yeah. hour. I sold my soul because of a person who's no, who's not even dead. <laughs> uh, All right. So as you guys get to the border, uh -huh. you see a figure in a green robe, mm. looking at the border. And there seems to be a table next to him as well. That's no, supplies just... on it. Hey, yo, guys, watch me. I'm gonna go talk Walk up to this ranger. Hail, traveler! Hold on, guys, I'm gonna make... Uh, so, wait, do we have... This is being pulled by, like, horses, right? Yes. Okay. What about my premonition, Creechel? <laughs> what was your question? There's a question? Yeah. You have to ask a question, Alpha. That's part of it. Read the spell. It's just uh, a divination spell. Ugh. Is it just one question or multiple? One question. Alright. Choose your questions wisely. Um, well, I have to ask it to what uh, Aiko would yeah. know. Oh yeah, one question about a specific concerning goal, event, or activity for the next seven days. Yeah. Right. Um, my question would be, uh, what's that, uh, guardian up there doing? <laughs> I don't know. I was expecting some cryptic, like, prophecy or something. I wonder if it's just teleporting. No, you, it's, you ask him a question about- You ask a question and you get a cryptic answer. Yeah. Now, now we have to think of stuff. Yeah, now I gotta think of the answer real quick. To him. <laughs> I mean, I don't think how I want to cross the barrier. You know what? Sure, I'll do that. Yeah, let's do that. That that should be something great. That sounds about. like some Ico would do. All right, how, how, how do I get how do I get across the barrier? All right. Yeah. Now. The answer is gonna be keep moving forward. All right. <laughs> God, that's that's so stupid! <laughs> that's the way it's supposed to work? <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, can I teleport in front of this guy? This won't get me killed at all. <laughs> Wait, you're just gonna <laughs> teleport like all of a sudden as we're riding? <laughs> yeah, if you wanna do that, go for it. Yeah. 
better than getting Who's actually the like controlling the cart right now? <laughs> um Technically it's in space in the middle. Yeah, <laughs> he's space. <laughs> yeah! She's gonna go crazy with it! Uh, I, feel like, I feel like I feel like Fightfist is like constantly being like, no, calm, calm down. <laughs> no, I want to have fun. like, where's the pet? Um, Fightfist like, where's the panic bar? Where's the panic bar? <laughs> so Fightfist. Yes. Oh. You never use that gun you carry around. Uh, yeah, it's it's it's, yeah, I, it's a little too big for me. <laughs> Do you think I could maybe use it? Hmm... Maybe... I'll trade you some health potions. How many health potions? <laughs> <laughs> how about two? Just two? Do you know how That's much I one. spent on this gun? <laughs> No idea. And then turns to Kaz. <laughs> I have blood, sweat, and tears go into these potions. Took me ages to figure out this recipe and get so efficient at it. Does she care though? Does she care? Kaz, like, a bit? It was like a thousand something. Uh, was it? Yeah. That's a fairly I think, I think expensive we split uh, the money. ornament. I think it was a thousand something. Kaz does remember the Sunwave's job. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we split the money amongst the party, the party pool. Well, it was, uh, all of Fainfits and most of Mary All of Mary Amman's and money, all of Fainfits's money, and somebody else pitched in. I think Ico's pitched in a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Yeah. So it was a lot. <laughs> Fine, yeah. Fainfix. What do you want? Uh, I don't know. Your immortal soul! Would you no! like to free fire? Say what? <laughs> uh, yes, please. <laughs> I pull out a potion. <laughs> how, how long does that last? <laughs> you can breathe fire three times after you drink this. Actually, let me look it up real quick. I don't know how long it lasts. Uh, how about we, instead of just trading, like, Potion for, you know, uh, gun. How about, uh, we do a, uh, like, you know, I'm like your favorite customer, I get discount sort of thing on potions. <laughs> okay. Deal. Alright. And, and those health potions and that fire potion. Okay, I'm just gonna put it health out potions. here. Discount. Okay. A and and the fire potion. <laughs> I'll hold on to the fire potion for now. Wait, wait, wait. No, that's not the deal. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is not cheap. And this gun's not cheap either. <laughs> cheap, cheap. Ico's gonna pipe up. We pulled money in for that gun. All of you. Yeah. And you let her carry it around. It's not like any of us is gonna make a better use out of it. More like for, uh, out of character reasons. <laughs> Ico's, just gonna, Ico's just gonna be like, it's not like I can even carry that thing. And she can? <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? She has to win the- oh, The gun's like-, like Four times bigger than Fame Fits. Oh my god. What's the logic behind that? Oh, there yes. isn't. Oh. There isn't any. Uh, scares, my, scares my strength score. That's my logic. So, fire potion and discounts. Hold on, let me look up the fire potion stats. You know what? I'm gonna type some. Because for some reason, why do I not have this right written down? When you find it, could you like uh, paste it in the chat so I can <laughs> copy it? Okay, you have to use it within an hour. But it's. Okay. 
new stipulation. Uh huh. Hold on. You can have the fire potion. Mm -hmm. If you don't use it within any city walls. What if there's a really good reason to? <laughs> <laughs> then you're going to ask me first. Uh, okay. You might want to get a promise on that. <laughs> and if you don't, I will use that gun to shoot you in the head. Did you see my Do we have a deal? Aaron? That's a bit, um, uh, extreme, don't you think? But it shouldn't be a problem now, right, Fainfix? Because you're going to promise not to breathe fire within any city walls. You're even going to say the words. <laughs> uh, um, uh, have to say it, promise. You have to say it. Uh, all right, <laughs> fine. Mm -hmm. Say it. Fine what? <laughs> say it. I promise not <laughs> to breathe fire inside of any city walls. Helena is gonna hand you the fire potion. <laughs> and Fainfitz gives you bad news. And I guess you should right. have a couple of my health potions too. All right. How, <laughs> how many health potions? Hey, please tell me you two. saw my message. Yeah, I saw it, Samantha. Yes. <laughs> what? Nothing. Uh, okay, I need bad. I need bad news stats. I'm uh, adding it for you right God, now. God, getting Fenfix awesome. to make a promise on something must be uh, as hard as it's getting like Fenfix to say please. <laughs> it's <laughs> like pulling teeth. If Wen forgets that one thing. No, 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 no. Pulling teeth. Deal, you're, uh, go no, that's uncultured. <laughs> no, it's like, no. Getting Fenfix to say uh, I promise to something is like uh, getting Grunkle Stan to say please. <laughs> 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 ah, it hurts just saying it. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> awesome. Is it just called fire potion? Uh, it's called potion of fire breathing. Oh, okay. Or fire breath. Alright. I don't think it's in roll 20. Alright, I mean, I'm just gonna ah. throw it onto, uh, so sorry, Shell, one second. Yeah, you're fine. Uh, I thought that you were copying stuff. I know. That is. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I get it. I don't know. Alright, so you can look at the thing. Like, like, worst part was it was like, just you know, the copy the last thing to. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, hold on. Let me double check and just firing for you to see I got it right. Nice. Uh, oh, and I should take off bad news for Yep. So, yep. What, once you finish. And then. Okay. Hold on. Now we. Uh, I don't know. And bad news is 25 pounds. If you're keeping track yeah. of that. Ooh, that's heavy. Yeah. I've been over encumbered for a long time because no, of that. You, you've been right at it because your armor would not weigh 10 pounds if you're small. Okay, so oh, I'm true. Gonna put in my inventory with a weight then. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah. So. I got it. Yep. And then, Red, you can delete you say, bad wait, news. Did now. you say 15 yeah. or 20 pounds? It's 25. 25. 25. It's heavy. So how much would my leather armor be since I'm much smaller? It'd be like half? Like five pounds? Four. Four? Probably. Yeah. Alright. Oh man, that's a lot of weight off my shoulders. <laughs> yeah, you lost like, what, 30 pounds? <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, as soon oh, as you get away, I think it weighs like half a pound or something. Uh, I haven't been keeping track of the potions, but. Like, yeah. I mean, they're yeah, not that. Uh, I mean, yeah, half a pound's like probably so good. Uh, I think that's all my potions. I don't know what half of this stuff weighs. Yeah, to think of everything Fenfix had, yeah, she lost like <laughs> one fourth of her total weight with gear. Yeah. Right, there. <laughs> right there, she lost a fourth of her total weight. Mm hmm. All right. Oh, and then I can get rid of bad news attack. Yeah. Where is it? Um, bad news. There it is. There we go. All right. Yep. Cool.
Cool. Uh, and so as soon as we finish that exchange, that's when uh, I believe. Uh, yeah, that's when Jack would. Yeah, him. Jack just vanishes, and Fane Fitz like turns back to Faye and is like, "Wait, where'd Jack go?" Oh, my, <laughs> my safety fee should be lower than that. All right, Jack. <laughs> fucking teleport! Hey, hey! At that point, he wouldn't just teleport normally. He just fucking tumbled to the floor for some reason. <laughs> Like, no, he doesn't just teleport upright, he teleports at like a diagonal angle. So he just fucking be collapsed on the floor right now, cause it's fucking funny. Okay. Fuck, that, that, damn it. He doesn't seem to have cared about you landing there. Uh, ah, fuck's sake, I don't, it's gonna get back up the table. Hey, hey, party people, fuck. What? Broke my bones. Wait, what? Wait, you're way over there. We can't hear you. Where did Jack go? <laughs> yeah, he's not about the same thing you're too what far. What happened? <laughs> I, I Can we see correctly. them from over where we are? Um, you are able to see the guy over here in the desk, not Jack, since he landed face first, apparently. Oh, okay. Where? Jack vanished again. Um, I don't know. We should probably go speak. So who is that? I don't know. Some dude looking at the shield thing. Well, maybe he knows something about it we don't. Yes, mysterious robed figures always know something we don't. That's just doing that. You see what you can see if he touches it. <laughs> and you see like a ripple effect across the entire shield. Jack gets back up. And he's doing Arthur. something mysterious. <laughs> Jack, Jack's just gonna get back up. Alright, hold on, let me try this again. Hey, 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 what's up, party people? God, fucking damn, that's so bad. Yeah, he's still not focused really? on you at all. I think... oh. What's up with you? I'm working. I can tell. It, it, there's a table here, looks fancy as hell, and you're currently touching a wall. Your point? So, mysterious hooded stranger, have you figured out how to get past it? Telepathically to the Guardian, don't trust the no. <laughs> don't trust the no! <laughs> so, as you tried to do that, it didn't seem to go through. Keep on Seems moving like forward. Seems like he has huh? a spell on him that prevents when any Fain, kind of uh, when mind. When Helena fusses at Fain Fitz, Fain Fitz is just like, ah. <laughs> um, excuse me? Keep on moving forward. Keep on moving forward. Keep on moving <laughs> forward. <laughs> Expected this. Uh, I know. <laughs> but, uh, but you told me to keep on moving forward, so I'm you moving can't get forward. past this. There's a wall. Yeah, that's the point. He's gonna keep moving into the wall. And keep getting bounced back. That's the point. Huh? You dumb dumb. Hey, I'm going, hey, Ico's going to attempt a fight against by getting bounced back and keep on moving forward. <laughs> And you get bounced back even farther. Uh, I, I go, is, that doesn't seem to be working. Fred Fitz is gonna peek on what's on the desk. Um, I'm also gonna peek what's on the desk. Alright, so Helena, when you peek, since you actually know this, you can see the exact same notes as the ones you got earlier at the library about the spell. Oh! Can I help you people, or are you just gonna stand there? We're just trying to pass through. You know about the spell. Yes, I do. And the barrier. Yes. In fact, you can say I'm the one who made it. What was the you guy's name? It was Leaf something? 
Leaf shield, leaf shield, leaf shield. Does leaf shield mean shield. anything? Or shield Not leaf? Not me, exactly, but I guess translation errors can occur. Oh? You... What, what's it supposed to mean? Did you commission Melissa? Yes, I did commission Melissa to make this barrier, but it was supposed to be much bigger than this small what one we have it? here. You can blame a ranger named Donald, but he's dead, so... <laughs> what is it exactly? The barrier here is to protect your universe from a worse event yet to come. Oh no, it's Cosma. <laughs> 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 oh yes, but <laughs> oh yes, but spoilers, Reg. <laughs> that doesn't happen for like another few days. <laughs> Wait a minute, that's just copyright. So it's this copyright. was supposed to go over the entire world? Your entire universe, yes. Oh god, here we go again. Then I thought I was supposed to just we really messed it up. Wait, yeah, I thought I was supposed to just pretend you know, this one country. Wasn't Whoa. the spell missing an ingredient? It was. That's probably the reason Hold it messed on. up then. You keep on talking before I can explain anything. <laughs> <laughs> so, the first spell was only supposed to cover this one continent. The finishing spell which I have is to cover the rest. Ow. Ten bucks he forgot his wallet outside the barrier, so now he can't cast it. So you're preparing to recast it again? Yes. However, since it is the full version, it takes much longer. <laughs> this version took long enough. <laughs> it can't be dead. You bad. casted this? A little bit. Interesting. I mean, all the people who were originally casting it died, so, you know. We stepped in, well, finished it. Yeah. <laughs> ah, well. Magic has something on science, so what can I expect there? They sure finished it. <laughs> Um, Very well. So, is there any way, you know, through it? You want to go through the barrier? I thought the fee is blocking. A little bit. Yes. We need to get through the barrier. There's trouble between Adidas and Agro. Fair enough, but I will tell you this once you leave, you're not coming back to until the spell ends. And when would that be? Um, I estimate if I'm not interrupted, two months, maybe faster. Two months? Is there any yes, way we there's can more than just stay? this world here. Is there any way we can stay in contact yeah, you already tried with the people the inside? Exposed. People on the inside. Um, who specifically are you looking for? Um, I, I, I guess I hadn't really thought that much about it. I just, is it possible? Because my sending stone has not been working. Who have you been sending me to? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm JFK right now. Oh. Because I I'm sorry, people. Talon keeps interrupting me. I'll be yeah, right back. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Ghost answer question. Talon interrupts. <laughs> 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 so, who are you? I go by Guardian in this, well, these parts anyway. Guardian. Ooh, that, that's cool it. Name. Just Guardian. Is that really a name? It sounds. It's not my name, it's my title I go by. Aww. My name I keep secret for my own reasons. Aww. 
So Sweet. you're a guardian of what? This world? This world and a few others, yes. I mean, that's pretty cool. Wait, the whole? Um, and you are guarding from what exactly? How could you go well, to the whole world? That's too much. High level events and also extinction. I right. Extinction. Yes, and that's why I'm casting this right now to prevent universal this is not extinction. It's impossible! You can't protect everything. And what exactly could cause that? To be honest, I don't know what's causing that right now. All I know is a very strong energy source is radiating from another universe. <laughs> Cosmo, Al. <laughs> wow, this, wow, it's almost as if this plot was thought of after another campaign. <laughs> 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 it's also going to tie in elsewhere, so yeah. you know. Well, this oh, part of the plot was. Uh huh. And huh. you think you can hold it back? Right? Well, that's why I'm doing this, helping so at least. Uh, help. Well, is there anything we can do to help? Not disturb me? That helps a lot. Right. Uh, Sorry. And to do that, um. Passing through would probably be the best way, right? <laughs> I don't know. What is it? Very well. Oh, I mean, we, we don't have anything better to do here, right? You, you can let us through, right? He just said he could. Um, yeah, just, we, we can't know, come back through. Do we know yeah. how far this barrier goes around? Like, you, know, you know it goes around the whole part of this kingdom. I mean, we have a general idea. We've been to several spots. Yes, but does it... Ah! Ah! Faye's like... Faye's on the fence because she doesn't know if it includes the same place or not. What place? Faye, what place are you concerned about? Ah, my hometown. Which is... Oh shoot, I didn't get off the thing yet! <laughs> <laughs> I He's the one bringing it up! Yeah. I'm bringing it up because of the failure, okay? Let me go I back to your chat and see if I know what <laughs> It's not any of the areas listed on the map. Is uh, I don't know. I was supposed to come up with a name, but I'm not... Either uh, way, it's... Yeah, just don't worry about it right now. <laughs> yeah. Okay. She's just worried that she might be away, be uh, unable to go to a family in two months. At Imaginary all. town no name content. inserted here. Okay. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> Wait, that will come up with later. <laughs> yeah, we'll come up with that later. Probably at the discussion. God damn it. Hmm. The village you're speaking of is not currently inside this barrier. Oh? So, any news on we're ready what, to go through. Anything you can tell us about what's going on on the other side? The other side? Well, you have your war between those two kingdoms, and I guess also the other on the other side against you as well. Nice. Wait. Adidas fighting a two-front war. That is correct. And eh, how's it going tonight. for them? Probably not good. I'll let you find it out yourselves. Cool. Have they broken Cast. the siege yet? The siege is still going on as we speak, so... Ah, uh, can't we, like, I don't know, stay here and wait it out? No. That would surely not go well. Okay. She just looks defeated. Oh, you you have like cosmic knowledge and knowledge of a whole bunch of stuff, right, Mister Guardian person? Depending on what it is, yes. Are there any gnomes on this continent? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Because I can't get a straight answer. He just Aside sighs from me. for a second. <laughs> 
And then you just see, like, a faint blue, like, flash go off. Caleb, is that you? And as that happens, you one of the continents, correct? Yeah. Oh. Not including you, there's somewhere between a thousand to two thousand. Oh. Uh... Mostly in more remote villages than towns. Oh. Any nearby? What is this, Tinder? (laughs) 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 You might find some in Northon if you make it there in time. Wait, what? In really? time! Can you like, continually bait fanfics with Nome? <laughs> yes! <laughs> and never give it to him. Perfect. Uh, and Fitz yes. is just like, alright, <laughs> let's do it for you. Continually fanfics on the side. Moving forward. Alright, if you have nothing else, I will let you go through. Uh, or wagon. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll just go grab the rest of our companions and our cart. Very well. Oh, yeah, speaking of the, which, Good luck on your venture. Thank oh, you. Actually, thank hold you. On. Mush! Will you be yeah, yeah, staying yeah. here yeah. for the two months you're casting the spell? Unfortunately, yes, I will. Very <laughs> jarring process. Oh. Well, at least um, you picked a. Nice spot. Yes, it is remote. That's why I picked it. Are there even any cults in the area? Oh my god. Wait, what? Good luck. Cults. Oh my god. This is so random. Not the immediate area. Hmm, enough. I guess I'm not gonna get Are you looking for the boss of Cole again? Well, good luck, Guardian. Yes, and I wish you guys luck in your adventure as well. Do you see him wave his hand? Mm-hmm. As you see on the the path to the road, oh. the barrier opens up like in a small hole that will let your wagon fit through. Ah. Nice. Guardian, Thank I you. need you to defeat the Cabal incursion. <laughs> okay, I'm driving the wagon again. Careful this time. No! I can't quite uh, so many bombs. No, I'll have fun! <laughs> I like how we've just made Faye the driver. Yeah. <laughs> it's so funny! Yep. Alright. Don't worry, I have a proficiency in the stars. I got this. You know what? I'm, 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 not, I'm not changing the, changing the direction. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Running. Woo, then we get through guys... the barrier! Uh-huh. And as soon as you pass through, it closes. I can go home! <laughs> do you want to go home though, or do you need trees? All right. And I mean, he's gonna stick around until he can convince at least some of you to join him. <laughs> I love, I love how your character business. is now just like goal of convince this party to be my. Yes. That's the only reason why he sticks around is you're not yet convinced. Hold on, I do want to put something out real quick. Eh, Faye doesn't mean... want to cut. Him. Fuck's sake, I was talking. Yeah, Martha. But yeah, funny enough, if I really wanted to, I can just teleport the entire party back into the, the uh, bubble and would kill everyone. You could try to. That means to no. kill uh, everyone. Doesn't that have to be like willing creatures? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Shit. <laughs> My DPK stands. Not yet, though. Let's see, there's seven of you right now. Oh, hold on. That's the pizza guy. I'll be right back. Oh. All right, I'll be right back too. Are we taking a break? Now? I don't think. So. No way. No, no. it's just... too early hey, for he's a break. Getting... He's just getting his pizza. That's it. All right. We're taking a break here. I don't know. Pizza, he's just getting pizza, please don't. Oh. Okay. 
thing we're just sitting here patiently. I mean, you can do, with, do some Attempts to befriend Venfix, still mm -hmm. searches for gnomes. <laughs> Gonna keep getting baited by gnomes, but you will find none. We'll find out. For you see, all the gnomes are actually secretly located in the Tarasque's belly. What? <laughs> no. no. We're not even a snack to a Tarasque. No, they're just air. They're just molecules of oxygen. The Tarrasque breathes gnomes. No, it doesn't. Oh my god. Hmm. Man, I can lift up some people. Ah, oh, man, negative strength? What's that? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I got negative strength. I can lift up boulders despite having negative strength. Alright, I do feel like we're taking a break, because... <laughs> Well, it won't be official break, but it probably will be a few minutes. I mean, they're gonna want to eat, so... Eh, true. I hope it's not break break, because I can't- I should take the dog out until later. Uh, until like know. an hour later. I mean, I could do an hour, but I'd kind of rather not. I guess you could say I'm lazy. <laughs> hmm. Um. Man, it's really taking Shell a long time to get pizza. Well, yeah, it's pizza. I mean, no, it's it was. The whole... he, like, it was just delivered to his door. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, but you have to do stuff like uh, figure out tips and stuff. I mean, that takes like a minute. I know. All right, just waiting for Aaron then. Oh. Um... See, he's back. We told you. Yeah. Yeah. I was tempted to go get breadsticks. Darn it. <laughs> we were I'm debating, here. like, are we taking our break now, or...? <laughs> I'm here. We can start. I mean, yeah, if you do want to take our break now, we can't do that. I mean, that's what, we can keep going. Yeah, let's go. Okay. We're I mean, a break, like, within break. the hour would be good, though. I need to do laundry. Okay, probably watch them for like next 20 or so minutes. Just probably do it then. Okay. Okay. As I, I just mean, swipe in, uh, crazy bread. What? Huh? Just quickly eating one of the slices of crazy bread. Oh. I wish I could have some pizza! I'm sorry, so you it. need to narrate the story you yeah. can't be eating right now. I want I'm just to eating the pizza! I <laughs> want the whole pizza to eat! Okay. What kind of pizza? What kind of pizza is it? Questions you'll find out later. <coughs> no, I want nothing. I'm eating an ice cream sandwich. Mm. Nice. Okay. Uh, I don't have one of those in forever. Hold on. Okay. Sandwich? Ice cream sandwich. So crossing yeah, like the barrier. A chocolate <laughs> yep, there we go. With yeah. okay. vanilla yeah. ice cream in the center, that type. Yeah. There are different types of ice cream sandwiches, like ones with chocolate, uh, cookies, mm. or other stuff. So anyways. I was just asking if it's the original one. Yeah. Alright, anyways, so. As you guys walk through, you come, you come across the river. Where is Alpha? But there is but there is a bridge that forms in front of you as well across the All river. Alright. Cool. Nice. So I guess we guys cross? go across the bridge. Okay. Yeah. Where is Alpha? But okay. Alpha's right here with us. Yeah. I thought. Oh, he went somewhere. No, he literally. Alpha, are you dead? It was a break. Alpha. Oh, did he actually think it was a break? <laughs> uh. 
Because we were talking about it, and I think, like, I asked, I and I think he just him. accepted that it was. I could go fetch him. Nobody listened to me. I'll fetch him. Do, 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 uh, get do, his uh, shell a second to eat. Yeah, I can just slice the never one in my face. Shove more food in your face? Yep. <laughs> no, it's so good. And I get to decide, to decide um, how many beers I want to drink. To oh, I haven't had any beers. Slackers! I'm sorry, I'm already two in. You are slacking. Oh my god. Alright, I gotta <laughs> go catch up. You just gonna chug two of them right now. <laughs> <laughs> no chug, it's gonna chug three. One in like his left side of his mouth, one on the right side, one right down the middle, all at mm -hmm. once. <laughs> that would be impressive and not something I could ever see Darian doing. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's got like the bottles between like his fingers as well as he's chugging like that, you know? <laughs> Fuck's sake, don't quit. Nice Welcome back, Alpha. Okay, I'm back. Oh, nice Ritz. fake break. Yeah, Ritz is gone because he needs to catch up. We found it, Al, it was fake. Oh, no. He's not, not actually gone. gone. He just was very red. temporarily not at his. Oh, really now? Red. Yeah, that sounds like gone to me. Sorry, I don't speak wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you are. I, mean, I, I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about, Marson. Like, uh, Red, you there? Mm-hmm. Yeah. See, Marson, he's been here <laughs> the whole time. Yep. Uh -huh. I definitely didn't like step out of the room for like. 20, 30 seconds. <laughs> and grab a beer. <laughs> Marshall's talking nonsense over here. When the fuck are those? I'm clearly gonna come back. Alright, anyways, we're crossing a bridge. Oh yeah! yeah. Is it clear yeah. Not yeah. No, yeah, they're I'm, still our missing. wagon's just floating over the ocean. <laughs> yeah, that's actually one way to put it. Like, It's more like your wagon's kind of floating over. Uh, okay. <laughs> In a way, with this bridge. But as you finally come across it, uh -huh. as you turn around, uh -huh. Instead of fading away like you think it would, uh, it's just a full chocolate bridge stretching across that whole length. Oh, wait, chocolate? Chocolate? Yes, oh, chocolate yes. bridge. Can I, like, no, no, bend no, down no, no. and, like, scrape some off with my finger and taste it? This is okay. one of when, when you're trying to scrape down with it, like, it's solid chocolate, you're not able to scrape it off. Oh. Aww. Fangfist is gonna be like, stop the wagon! <laughs> what, Martha? <laughs> this is gonna. Don't make this be a Gustus Gloop. I mean, stop the funny. wagon! This <laughs> literally is what the delayed bomb is. I'm gonna hop off of the, the cart onto the chocolate thing. because I wanna, I wanna investigate it further. <laughs> Fangfist right. is doing Where the same. You're standing on top of the chocolate bridge. Yes! <laughs> standing on the cart? We're gonna fall! Investigation! Um, this would actually be Arcana. Oh, Arcana. Arcana! Yes! Uh, no more listening to me! Oops, that was secret. Uh, <laughs> you know what I rolled? Yeah. Uh, if you're both, like, looking over this for a little bit, uh -huh. you start to realize this is probably done by wild magic or something. Oh. oh. Who's Wild like... Magic? You have no idea. I would say the fake. What? <laughs> uh, Fainfitz is gonna like try and break a piece of chocolate off of the bridge. <laughs> what are you using? Uh, do I need to use something? <laughs> yes. Uh, I guess for my dagger. <laughs> Alright. Your Pretty dagger? Yeah. <laughs> 19, yep. Rough damage. <laughs> okay, yeah. So as you use your dagger to, like, dig into it, you're mm. able to get out a small piece. Okay. Uh, I guess I, uh, bite it. Slowly. Alright. What is it like? So 
so as you go to slowly bite it, uh -huh. it turns like super soft and nice in your mouth. Oh. And it would taste like your favorite chocolate. Oh. Yummy. How is it? <laughs> very, very good. <laughs> Let's collect as many as we can. I'm gonna try and break some chocolate off. Yeah, All right. give Thanks. chocolate. Well, let me spend some favorite. time just breaking chocolate. Yeah. yeah. We're Sorry. like, we need this. We need it. Why is this yeah. bridge? Insane? They all take a while to take some of the chocolate bridge apart and take it with you. Thing. Yeah, <laughs> that'll probably take you about take about an hour altogether. You probably get about twenty pounds of chocolate. <laughs> That's a lot of chocolate. <laughs> okay, we don't need to spend that long. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Maybe like half that time. Yeah. Half an hour. Half an hour for ten pounds, okay. Yes. Why? There's so now ten good? pounds of chocolate. I feel like this on is the a cart. I'm getting. Yeah, I genuinely don't even know what's going on. I try to play an intelligent character, but that is a fucking chocolate spread. I genuinely <laughs> give up. <laughs> I fucking give up. There is a lot of typing. Dog, what are yeah. you typing? <laughs> I'm getting Claire caught up. She says she's gonna be here in like fifteen to twenty minutes. Okay. okay. So right where we have the break now. Yep. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I was just like, it's right. really loud. <laughs> so then, oh, yo, a few days travel. Uh huh. Get you about close north on. A few days travel means that I can take my infusion Wait, off of my crossbow. Why, why and put is it, it sound wave and yeah. not epic? Yeah. Uh, they changed it at some point in last session. Mm. All right. Now the question I asked you: uh, Do you want to enter Northon during the day or at night? Uh, since it's under siege, probably at night. <laughs> I would think that'd be the safest. <laughs> All right. We could, yeah, but we need to try and be stealthy about this. Yeah. So oh, night not is. Want to attract? Well. I say we get the there kind of in the day so we can see what's the lay yeah, of the land. Yeah, maybe. Okay, get like get, get there ahead of time. The but yeah, yeah, but then not Wait, actually guys. try and enter Norfa until. Yeah, until night. Guys, I agree. Should I, should I be disguised okay. before we get into Northon? I mean, we're not entering it immediately. Yeah, I don't know if you actually need a disguise, Faye. I don't think you need a disguise. You're also Faye. already disguised from, like, what you. Look like last time. Yeah, but yeah. I look mad now. So, Aquan people are gonna shoot at me. At I mean, they're gonna shoot at us anyway. Yeah. They will automatically shoot at you. Also, that. Being Only if they you spot sure? you. I mean, we'll find oh. out. I think. What are you talking about? I'm not affiliated with this party. I go! Alright, so then. As you guys get close enough, but not too close, mm -hmm. we are able to see that the city is still under is currently being under siege right now. Yeah, there's a lot more fires towards the east side, mm -hmm. but like the rest of it seems more fine or less. It okay. looks like they haven't even broken down the first wall yet, at all. Hmm. To just create another so wait, wall there's now? nothing North between North us right. and the gate. On this side? Um, to your knowledge, there's nothing between you and the gate on that side. Huh. Well, this is a really crappy siege. <laughs> you could literally just, you know, drive a wagon right through. With supplies. This kind of, kind of uh, makes the siege a waste of time. <laughs> this doesn't make any sense. I don't even Why would... It. They only be all of their forces on one side. There's no one even guarding the other side of the city. They could. I thought the whole point of a siege was to cut off supply routes. Yeah. I could use my premonition ability to find out. Hmm. You have a way to, to find out what's going on, I go. Well, friend, Preminence. <laughs> no, I was not going to say that in character, but <laughs> I am going to do this. I mean, we can interrogate the hostage. So, All great right. show. Uh, why, is, why are they attacking uh, solely on the east side? 
when the west side's completely, like, vulnerable. The main force is on one side. Ah, the stealth division. Aiko's, got, Aiko's going to speak up in the party. Perhaps the main force is on the left side. On the east side of the north on. We're on the east side of north. Um, I don't think side. you're paying attention, Jog, because I we are clearly on the... We are on the, on east, the side. east side. Are we on the east side? Which yeah. way is the compass pointing? <laughs> ah, oh, wait, sorry. Like normal map. Yeah, yeah, where's yeah. the compass? It's the wrong way. I'm sorry. Unless the map is upside down. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. It's on the wrong way. It's on the west side. That's on me. Oh, okay. Okay, so just to yeah. be clear. All the armies are on the west side. The east side appears to be clear. And Ico's yes. vision whatever thing just said the main force is on the west side mm. i reiterate yes. that that okay. sorry that feel when jog tries to make me look like an idiot but makes the dm look like an idiot instead <laughs> hey dm yeah. i suggest a smite as long as someone looks like an idiot i'm happy unless it's <laughs> me in which case meh <laughs> kind of make that work all right hmm yeah i guess they they'd have to be covering it somehow um how are we going to sneak past people we can't even see? I wonder, we could, maybe we could teleport in like sane people. I say we send in bait. What? There's, oh, there's, a <laughs> <laughs> there's a jack. Bait! There's a jack? I can realize I can literally just teleport you in front of that siege, right? But Jack, you're so adept at teleporting. You could leave yeah. them all away and then teleport out of there. Lead an entire army. Yeah. And play chicken with them. <laughs> you have Not an insurance plan, army, right? Just, <laughs> just the portion that is keeping, uh, staying hidden on the east side of the city. Or we could just all teleport in there, like seeing people. How far can you teleport? A mile. Really? But you yeah. wouldn't be able to take the wagon. Oh. <sighs> just push it for parking or something, I don't know. I'm not leaving my lab. Unless you can put it in a 5x5 five five foot cube, you're fucked. Then we're we're left with stealthing him. Fucking damn it! We go under All the right. cover of darkness. We keep everything quiet. No, no, no! If we go in under the dark, they'll just assume we're spies, and we'll get attacked. The spot. Um. No, they won't. Yes, they will. We're in a world where we can literally send telepathic messages to each other. If they find a spy there, the first instinct is to kill them before they do magic. What? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Was that it or elf killed That That was in character. <laughs> You sounded like both. It, it was kind of both, but... Oh my god, fucking damn it, why does William have to be gone? So, Look. What, what do we do? I have a siege elemental. You want to use siege elemental? We need okay. some sort of distraction, probably. No, you... Why? How can you use that? We don't want to help the siege. Uh, Shell, can think it's just like look around, see if she can see anything. But um, what specifically like a, you're looking for? Like any like signs of like a hidden army or anything? I'll like, have you uh, roll perception real quick. All right. Perception. Ah. Um, even as you have the elevation advantage, you're not mm. seeing any other possible armies so far. Okay. 
And then Aiko, with your role, you would assume, well, you start out a little bit ways out, and there's still like a little bit of a foresty area that there might be some forces hiding in, but it wouldn't be anywhere close enough to actually pull a sneak attack off on the city. Unless it was done in the cover of night. I'm going to mention that to the party. I'm going to mention that uh, there could be a secret army hiding right around there that might be waiting to attack on the cover of night. Oh. So... Hmm. Those just confuse us for the army and we'll still die. So, so either we go now off. or we go during an attack. Possible. Well, we do a stupid sure. decision. How does the party go? Wait a minute. We can just... I can just try to kidnap um, someone and we'll interrogate them. <laughs> That's so well, wait stupid. a minute, wait a minute. I go, there, that's a good spot for an army to be. We don't know that there's something there. Exactly. Someone has the ability to teleport quite a distance and could go check for us. <laughs> there's it, Jack. <laughs> someone, and I mean, Jack is going to do said thing. Right, Jack? Just try not to bring anyone else back with you this time. <laughs> no, no, no. We're going to bring someone back and we're going to interrogate the shit out of them. Watch me. Alright. So, Jack, you teleporting? Give me a sec. Do a little, do a bit, do a fucking boom. Alright. That, that, that was the key for the teleportation. Yeah, I know. So, make a perception check. That's good. The army is right in front of you, dumbass. Alright, <laughs> uh, okay. 22, okay. Okay. So, Jack, as you're currently looking around, you don't see any forces, but there is a cloaked individual walking through the woods right now. Hmm. What goes the cloak? Um. It's more of like a blue and purple mix. Hmm. Be the best way to describe it, like kind of like it's both blue and purple, but it like mixes in with patterns all along it. Hmm. So it's like a cloak of elven kind. Not, not, it's not Cloak of Elven Kind, that's just the design of the cloak. Oh, okay. It's not changing, it's just that. Mm. Okay, I can detect 17 different possibilities, most of which are stupid. They don't seem to have currently noticed you. Mm. Oh, what the heck, it'll notice me anyways. All right, let's telepathically communicate. Oh God. We gotta hear him screaming in our head soon. I'm no, no he, he's communicating with the person. Yeah. Oh. All right. What do you say? Yo. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just yo. <laughs> This is a formal greeting. Let's see if they know what to okay. do. Why, hello? What brings you here? Person in my head. <laughs> and, as, and as she said that, she taps her head. <laughs> well, um, actually, I am literally like 20 feet from you. Uh, um, I think okay. I've been sent away by like five other people here because I think that they think I scammed them or something. It's more of a hostage situation, really, but still. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> I mean, you can kind of leech off of them, I'll be honest here. Like, I'm not even sure I'm why about they keep to leech off money. of you in a moment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you're the terrible one then. I mean, somewhat, yeah. Wow. Um, so, what brings you here? I'll be honest, he kind of just told me to go over here. They didn't tell me exactly what else to do. 
Oh, you poor soul. I mean, I'm probably gonna get ambushed by like 17 different ninjas or something, but still. <laughs> oh, no. There's no ninjas here, just me. Roll insight. If you want to roll, you can. <sighs> Alright. I thought Jack could, like, always sense lies in telepathy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's true. You don't sense any lies. Mm. But you are getting a strange feel. As in, there's more than one, there's like more people inside like this link right now than you think. Well, not link, more people inside this mind, I should say. Than oh. just you two. Oh? Uh... <laughs> Call her so up. I? Call her up. Call who out? The person he's talking to. Well, I'm gonna be uh, off on my way real quick. Just uh, open a gate. <laughs> but as you try to do that, it gets counterspelled. Uh oh. <laughs> now, who said you could leave? <laughs> we were just getting to know each other. <laughs> Alright then. Good enough. And that there is where we're going to take our break. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, the cliffhanger! Beautiful. <laughs> you finally uh, dropped the mystic. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and, it's the, the, and, and the best part is, Jack has no idea who he's messing with, and I'm just <laughs> laughing my head off right now, the knowing best, what's about to happen. The best part is... Claire! Oh, Claire. Oh, Claire's, Claire's here. here. Perfect time is break time! Break time! You made it just in time for the break, and you're about to see Donald, I mean, Jack get beat up. <laughs> cool. Yeah! I still have work to do, but it seems like stuff is going on, so I'm just gonna, like, sit around and try right. to play Well, I mean, it's break right. time, so... Yeah, we're just <laughs> going to break now. Chickens! Yeah, I do have did to you feed the chickens? chickens? I have not. I have you not. can do it right now! 